étudiants 7 Standard, I welcome you all to this new session, Lesson 4, Les Parents de Manuel. So from this lesson, we are going to learn uh, vocabularies and uh, professions. So you can see this image, they are from different professions. He is an electrician and she is a doctor and I think this guy is a... I think he must be a manager, okay, so regional director and something. So this lesson mostly we will be seeing a lot of professions. So so start with we'll start with the vocabulary. We'll start with the vocabulary as usual and then we will move on to the dialogue. So first we'll start with Apreno. So you can take page number 52. And let's start with the Apreno. And then we will move on to profession. Lambasad. So the first uh, pro I mean uh, vocabulary is Lambasad. The meaning is embassy. Lambasad. Embassy. Le bâtiment. Le bâtiment. Bâtiment means building. Le bâtiment. Le directeur régional. Le directeur régional. The regional manager. So that's what I was talking about just now. Le directeur régional. L'entreprise. L'entreprise. L'entreprise means company. Any company, they, it was called as enterprises, and uh, it's also this word also exists in English. L'entreprise. Once again, repeat. L'entreprise. The next word is l'hôpital. L'hôpital. La maison. La maison. House, though this word is well known to you. Le médicament. Le médicament. Médicament. Le médicament. Medicine. Medicines. So whatever medicine a doctor subscribes us, it is called as le médicament. La mer. La mer. La mer means sea. La montagne. La montagne. Montagne means mountain. La musique classique. La musique classique. This is called as classical music. So, in English we will say classical music, but in French it is in a reverse method. La musique classique. L'oiseau. L'oiseau means bird. L'oiseau. Le plan. Le plan. Plan, there are two types. One is map. So, if we plan something, we will say uh, c'est un bon plan and uh, if we otherwise if we have a map it is also called as a, le plan le pont le pont le pont means bridge okay so when you see a bridge next time see and uh, you can say le pont okay le pont repeat along with me le pont la jeunesse la jeunesse is a french word that means Youth, youngster, we, we can also say youngster, la jeunesse. So, this time, uh, this side is verbs. Adore, adore, adore. Adore is to adore. If you adore something, you can say j'adore. Okay, j'adore ça. Next word is construire. Construire means to construct. Construire. Construire, construire. To construct. Marche. Marche means to walk. Marche. Nage. Nage means to swim. Nage. Osculte. Osculte means to examine. Osculte. So if you go to a doctor, uh, the doctor uh, examines you, right? So uh, the previous lesson we learned something about uh, the doctor examined a, do a dog, okay? So the same way, osculte. Prefare. Prefare is to prefer. Prefare. Repare. If you repair something, it is repare, to repair. Swangye. This is a new word, a stylish word. Swangye, to look after. If your parents look after you, they take care of you, and this is the verb you have to use. Swing ye. Travaye. Travaye. Repeat. 
travaille. Travaille means to work. Je travaille. I means I work. Visite. Visite is to visit. If you visit a place, that is called visite. Next, voyage. 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 To travel. And adjectives. Two adjectives we have from this lesson. First one is primair, premier, and surion. So this is primair, and another word is called as premier. That is also a same uh, pronunciation. You can learn this word alone first. Primair. Primair means primary. That is first thing we have to do. Surion. Surion means pleasant. Smiling face, like a pleasant one. Okay. So I will once again repeat the vocabulary. Then we will go for the. Uh, Pro, 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 professions okay lambasad embassy so repeat along with me don't uh, keep idle le batimo building le directeur régional regional director regional manager l'entreprise company l'hôpital hospital la maison house le médicament medicines la mer sea la montagne, mountain, la musique classique, classical music, l'oiseau, bird, le plan, map, le pont, bridge, la jeunesse, youth, adorer, to adore, construire, to construct, marcher, to walk, nager, to swim, ausculter, to examine, Prefer it to prefer, repair it to repair, swing it to look after, travail it to work, visit it to visit, voyage it to travel. Adjectives: primer, surion. So we are done with the pronoun. Now let's move on to the images. So let's learn the professions with some images. And once I have taught you the images, you can learn this page. Okay, so this page is without images. That is page number 50. That is, if I introduce a profession, it has two things. One is male and one is female. So, lavoka means uh, advocate. So, male advocate, you can say lavoka. And female advocate, you can say lavokat. Okay, so from this, you can learn. So, let's now learn with the with the images okay so first profession we are going to see here is les professions this profession is always called as les métiers so les métiers so please uh, repeat along with me les métiers les professions les métiers la commerçant so if you have a small shop if your parents one of your parents have a small shop uh, you can say la commerçant mon père est un commerçant so you can say la commerçant, a small shop. L'avocat. So this lady is a female lawyer. So that's why it is written l'avocat. And uh, the news readers and uh, the people who search for news, they are called as le journaliste. Le journaliste. So once again, the first one is la commerçant, l'avocat, le journaliste. And the following thing is l'artiste. So if you know the drawing, you are an artist. So you can say l'artiste. So repeat along with me. L'artiste. Le peintre. So if you are a painter. Le peintre. Artist is different from painter. So you must know the difference. Le peintre. So pilot. Le piolet. Le piolet. And the next word is le dentiste, who takes care of your teeth. Le dentiste. La secrétaire, secretary, it's called as la secrétaire. Le musicien, le musicien. Le mécanicien, le mécanicien. So the next one is l'électricien. So electrician in French it is called as 
électricien, électricien. Le serveur. So if you go to a hotel, you can see le serveur. So this page, once again, we will revise. Les professions, is always called as les métiers. La commerçante. La commerçante. So I am repeating once again because I want you to repeat. L'avocate. L'avocate. Le journaliste. Le journaliste. L'artiste. L'artiste. Le peintre. Le peintre. Le piolet. Le piolet. Le dentiste. Le dentiste. La secrétaire. La secrétaire. Le musicien. Le musicien. La mécanicien. La mécanicien. L'électricien. L'électricien. Le serveur. Le serveur. La chanteuse, la chanteuse, the singer is called as chanteur or chanteuse, okay, so since this is a female singer, we call this girl as chanteuse. L'institutrice, l'institutrice is a school teacher, okay, l'institutrice, in case if this is a male, it is l'institutor, so that's what uh, you will learn in the tabla column. So this is l'institutrice. Le facteur, le facteur, the postman, le facteur, la danseuse, la danseuse, this is la coiffeuse, so hairdresser is called as la coiffeuse, le vendeur, le vendeur, Next is nurse, l'infirmière, l'infirmière, le professeur, le professeur, le cuisinier, le cuisinier, so cook is always called as le cuisinier, butcher is called as le boucher, le boucher, le boulanger. Le boulanger. So the people who make cake, bread, they are called as le boulanger. The person who sells fish, le poissonnier. Le poissonnier. So once again, we will see this page from the beginning. Please repeat along with me. La chanteuse. La chanteuse. L'institutrice. L'institutrice, le facteur, le facteur, la danseuse, la danseuse, la coiffeuse, la coiffeuse, le vendeur, le vendeur, l'infirmière, l'infirmière, le professeur. Le professeur, le cuisinier, le cuisinier, le boucher, le boucher, le boulanger, le boulanger, le poissonnier, le poissonnier. So two more uh, professions which is left out here is l'acteur, acteur, l'acteur. And the last one is le directeur. Le directeur. So these professions are repeated once again here. But here it is in the form of male and female. So this we will see in another, another day. We will not, let's not see everything in the same day. Okay, so you must learn this. Because based on this there is an exercise. So based on this there is an exercise. So that will be our next class. And after finishing that only, we can uh, see the dialogue. Because the dialogue consists of everything. That is vocabulary as well as profession. 
So if you see this excess, qui est ce? Répondez selon l'exemple. Il répare des voitures. Il est mécanicien. So if you are interested, you try solving this excess. Il travaille à l'école primaire. So she works at primary school. So who is she? She is an institutrice. Elle joue du piano. So if a person plays piano, who is that? Musician. Il travaille dans un hôpital. So there are keywords. Hôpital is the keyword. So it might be doctor or nurse. So check what is that. Elle fait du pain. So the person who does bread. So it should be boulanger. Il travaille dans un journal. So journalist. Il soigne des malades. So the people, the person who takes care of the people who are sick. So médecin, doctor. Il fait des pains, des gâteaux. Again, it is boulanger. So likewise, you can try this if you want. Anyway, I'll teach you this once again. So I'm just telling you, you must learn the professions to solve this exercise. So exercise number two, you can skip it and. Uh, Exercise number three we will see later. So whatever we have seen today is first uh, we saw this vocabulary, a preno, this page, and just now what we have learnt is profession. So I'll read out this once and then we will wind up the class. Lavoka, uh, lavokat. So the meaning is same, advocate. But it is lavoka. You should not pronounce the t here, and you have to pronounce the t here. Okay, you should not pronounce the t here, and you must pronounce the t here. So that is the difference. Lavoka, lavokat. Le commerçant, commerçante. Électricien, électricienne. So please repeat along with me. Mécanicien, mécanicienne. Le musicien, le musicienne. So if you see. I'll just give a short sound here and a long sound here. That is it. Actor, actrice. Le directeur, la directrice. Le facteur, la factrice. L'instituteur, l'institutrice. Le chanteur, la chanteuse. Le coiffeur, la coiffeuse. Le danseur, la danseuse. Le serveur, la serveuse. Le vendeur, la vendeuse. Le boucher, la bouchère. Le boulanger, la boulangère. La, le cuisinier, la cuisinière. L'infirmier, l'infirmière. Le poissonnier, la poissonnière. These things which is written in, uh, in in the form of star, okay? There is star indication. That means the both male and female. We have to give the same pronunciation. L'artiste, both male and female. Le dentiste, la dentiste. L'ingénieur, l'ingénieur. Le journaliste, la journaliste. Le peintre, la peintre. Le piolette, la piolette. Le professeur, la professeur. Le secrétaire, la secrétaire. Le vétérinaire, la vétérinaire. Ok, so next one is l'écrivain, l'écrivain. Le médecin, le médecin. So this means, two stars means, both for male and female, the spelling will not differ. Your le, la will differ in one single star. But here that too will not change. So if you see the note here, they would have given some professions have the same form in the feminine and masculine form. That is one single star. Some profession exists only in the masculine form. So this profession exists only in the masculine form. Le, le. So that is le médecin, l'écrivain. So that's it for today guys. So your today's online test will be vocabularies from this lesson. And uh, professions based exercise we will see in another uh, one. So only uh, vocabulary I will be asking for today's online test. So prepare well for that. It's short and simple. Merci mes étudiants. Bonne journée. Au revoir.